day 28, Bobby Buns Road Food City. And today I want to share with you one of my favorite recipes that I just concocted. All right, I can't keep this from you because I'd go to hell, hell, if I kept this a secret. I just made the most amazing juice. Now look, you gotta get excited about some of these things that you concoct. Cocked. All right? And I'm more than excited. You see my excitement, right? Just letting you know, I'm letting you know. I got this a long time ago, okay? It's still amazing. You know, it's like, it's almost like a cranberry, but it's just, it's just, it turns your juice into, it has this little bite to it. It has, it's very cranberry-ish, kind of, okay? But it, it's powerful stuff. Like one tablespoon of this will turn in your drink into a dark red berry juice. Absolutely amazing. Don't ask me. The Makai Berry, it's a wild-grown superfruit native to Chile where they have been consuming it by the Mapuche people for centuries to help boost immunity, strength, and stamina. Their rich purple pigment, indicative of potent antioxidants such as anticoncatenine and polyphenols. In fact, the Makai has the highest known antioxidant content of any fruit even higher than the acai. <laughs> Don't ask me, okay? With its naturally sweet flavor similar to blackberries, Makai tastes better than the acai too. Plus, it makes anything it touches a stunning shade of purple. See what I'm saying? Makai berry powder also has calcium and iron as well as vitamins A, C, B1, and B3. No wonder why this little berry is one of our favorites. It packs quite a punch. Well, let me tell you something about it. Now, okay, we're making this video a little bit too long. We're, we're talking about the Makai berry, but this, this, just, just, just buy yourself a bag, you won't, you won't regret it. Okay, so this is what I did. I got like a power green. Go get a power green bag. You get this at Costco, Trader Joe's. Nice mix of spinach, kale, and chard. Right? Throw it in the blender. Put your water in there, spring water, and blend it up. Strain it. You're going to get a lot of green juice, okay? Go to Trader Joe's. Go get this unpasteurized, fresh squeezed orange juice. $5.99. Half a gallon. Bam, right? Strain it because it comes with pulp. Get the pulp out, give it to the dog. Buy this, cold pressed pineapple juice. This is their new thing here at Trader Joe's. It's a little expensive, right? This is $3.99 for 12 ounces. Well worth it because it's, it's basically the same amount of juice that you're gonna get from a pineapple. So you're buying a pineapple, right? So there you go. You got this and you got this. You strain this. You mix both together with the power green mix that you just strained. Oh, throw this in the blender too, a habanero, right? So I take some organic basil. This is at Trader Joe's too. Organic basil, you know, a few leaves. Throw that into the mix with the power greens. And then you cut a lemon in half and you put that in there. You squeeze the lemon in there. So what this juices and at the end is this it comes out to be this color half about this much orange because now you could you could save the orange juice right you can save for another batch you get this orange and you got the pineapple then you got the green then you got some lemon right and then you could add water too because this stuff oh and then and you pinch this in I, I, I am not, I'm not kidding you. I'm not kidding you. The color is freaky because you've got green and purple, right? 
So it's kind of like, it almost comes out brown. Right? I, I can't, I can't, I can't. I need you here, I need you here. I need you to try this. It's absolutely mind blowing. It's absolutely, it's, and it's packed with power. It's packed. Mm. I forgot the apple cider vinegar. So I put a tablespoon of that in there too. With a squeezed lemon. The pineapple juice. The orange juice. The strained power greens with your basil and your habanero. And a tablespoon of Makai powder. Oh my God. Thank you, God. It's just so good. Fast and easy. Today is day 28. And if you didn't know already, me and Juice and Mama, when she did a 100 day fast, we were both on the same 100 day feast that we were trying to do. And today is the day I called her quits. Um, and it's so funny because this morning when I woke up, I didn't feel good. So that yesterday worm, Something's going on. Something's going on. Something's breaking down. And today's not the best of days. Uh, yeah, I felt like a little sore in my throat almost. Like a little bit of boogie going on. A little something going on. A little kind of fluey like, you know? Didn't want to hit the rebounder today. Um... Not a fun day, but I'm just going to relax. And I'm just going to let my body do its thing. All right? And get real quiet and talk to the man upstairs and get and have me hit day 29. And I'm sure I'm going to have these moments again. And I'm just going to do the same thing. I'm just going to chill. Nice cold shower, do a little Wim Hof, do some breathing, ask, ask the man upstairs for another day, baby. And just keep going, because this is a marathon, and I ain't breaking, no way, nothing can break me, not on this one. 72 days? What 72 days? I got 72 days. Bring it on. Bring it on. Hit me with the... Slap me in the face with the flu right now. I don't care. I'll punch you in your face. Peace. Love. World Food City. Bobby Buns, I love you. I was wrong and I just